Now we're going to have a look at some more advanced ceiling options and in our previous lessons in the courses we've uh, had a flat ceiling and now we're going to show you how to do a different type of ceiling options. A little bit more advanced but uh, I'm going to try and explain it to you. And I'm going to just create a wall dividing the, the this big room into two sections. Then I'm going to click inside this area and I'm going to select a new ceiling height. So let's pick a lower ceiling height, 4 meters. And if we go into 3D now, you'll see that we have basically two rooms with two different ceiling heights. Like that. So we have 8 meter and 4 meter. But now I want this to be one big wide open area. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this single wall that we added and I'm going to choose to hide that wall. So if we do that now, we'll see that it's actually one big open area. Like this, we'll move over here. So we'll move over here. And in 3D, it will look like this. So now we have one big open area with two ceiling heights. We'll do an undo and step backwards here. I'll create a new uh, section here. And instead of selecting one of the sides and changing the, uh, the room height for one of the rooms here, I'm going to click on the wall itself. And then I'm going to select a higher value here for both side A and side B. So that's what I have in the wall property menu here. Let's select the height of uh, 10 meters for side A and also for side B, 10 meters. And we're going to hide that wall again. So now it looks like this. We do have two sections of this room, but we hidden this wall and made the single wall section, which is hidden 10 meters high on both sides, A and B. If we go into 3D, we'll see what this looks like. Here we go. Let's see from this view as well. There we go. So now we made a different type of ceiling. We'll do one more sample. We'll remove that wall section again. And now I'm not going to split up the room. I just want to create a sloping ceiling here. And I'm going to make sure that my room is 8 meters to start off with. Then I'm going to click on one of the sides here. Let's choose this side. And I'm going to select a wall height of, let's do it a little bit extreme, 12 meters. So now this wall will be starting at 12 meters and it will be sloping down to 8 meter along this side. So we'll check what that looks like. Here we go. It's Here we go. Here's the result. As you can see, we have a sloping ceiling here. 